Hello, this is Dr. Gay from Forsake MRI, and this is a 22-year-old male who had an injury of their knee. They felt a pop in the lateral aspect and subsequent pain. And if we look over here at our lateral collateral ligament complex, we see that they have a sprain. So this is the fibular collateral ligament where it comes off the lateral femur. Here's your tibia down here. So we see the fibular collateral ligament looking a little gray here. So this may be a low-grade sprain. The central part or mid aspect looks pretty normal. This is nice dark tendon. And then distally where it comes down, it becomes part of the conjoined tendon and it will attach to the fibular, uh, the fibular head over here. And so between here and here it looks good. Here it's puffy and gray. And then the distal fibular collateral ligament and conjoined tendon are just too gray. So there's a sprain there. This is the biceps muscle comes down here as a really low muscular tendon junction where the muscle ends and becomes a tendon. It, it blends in with this fibular collateral ligament and becomes a conjoined tendon. So these posterior fibers of it are intact coming from the um, biceps, but the anterior fibers of the conjoined tendon coming from this fibular collateral ligament are thickened. So we can see the same thing on an axial image. On the axial image, this is a pie. It looks a little puffy right at the origin there. It looks like a mild sprain from near the... Uh, femoral attachment and we're going to come down looks good here and we keep coming down now we get into this um, increased signal you can see a little stellate bright signal between the longitudinal fibers and you can also see this bright uh, or the edema in the surrounding deep soft tissues and so this is a mild or moderate sprain of the fibular collateral ligament and adjacent conjoined tendon and edema around it now the popliteus is really tough it, here it is right here the popliteus muscle tendon it swings around here it goes underneath the fibular collateral ligament when this is torn sometimes this can also be torn and the popliteus tendon is really difficult because it a lot of times it will look gray because of magic angle phenomenon and so it can be challenging sometimes to say is this magic angle phenomenon do i even want to mention this because it's a tough call and so in this case i might say there's a you know questionable sprain of the underlying uh, popliteus tendon here's where it is right here does it gray, but again, this uh, even in normal patients, this may have a little bit of bright T1 signal within it. If we put out the T2 weighted sequence, this is a fat suppressed uh, PD sequence. Looks pretty good here. Um, and this is the bright signal at the origin. And then right here, this is where you have the partial tear of the fibular collateral ligament. And you can see that edema surrounding. Now, this patient had one other finding that's um, just as subtle as this, and it is the meniscus, lateral meniscus. Here's the medial meniscus looking great. If we jump over to the lateral meniscus, we're going to see some really subtle finding. So there's no articular surface tear. Top, bottom look great. But the posterior horn, there's funny contour here. Instead of being nice and triangular, usually there's a pointy inner margin and the outside is nice and straight. But this has lost that peripheral vertical contour. And you can see the inferior aspect is kind of crumpled inwards. And there's a funny little thing here. And this may be the, one of the, uh, the inferior meniscus fascicle. They have these popliteal meniscal fascicles. And uh, one is up high, another one down low. And they give it the nice straight contour. And it looks like this patient may have a tear of this inferior fascicle. And maybe that's why this contour um, is abnormal. It's, if it uh, uh, tears, then the meniscus, the undersurface can drift inwards a little bit like this. Again, this is a very soft call, may not be true, but uh, um, this is, uh, again, may explain why they have that funny contour. And that's it. Thank you very much.